Hi, this lesson is going to be about turns, and this is Homelink 6.7 for Everyday Math 3rd grade. And the lesson is about turns for the title, but it's really a way for you to get better with your angles um, and degrees, which we'll get to later in Everyday Math. Okay, and this is a bit of a challenging lesson because there's a couple things you need to understand before you can do it, so we'll go over that first. The first idea you need to understand is that of clockwise. When you hear the word clockwise, you're talking about which way, which direction something is turning. Okay, so if you have a clock, a clock moves in this direction, so this is called clockwise. So if you hear someone say clockwise, just think you're turning the same way that a clock turns. The opposite of clockwise is called counterclockwise, which means you're going the opposite direction that a clock goes. So going backwards on the clock, the way it would normally turn, is called counterclockwise. So counterclockwise would be going this direction all the way around is counterclockwise. And I think uh, maybe British people or Australian people c might call this anti-clockwise. Same thing. And this home link is called counterclockwise, opposite of how a clock normally turns. Now for your home link, you have to do uh, turns, different directions, counterclockwise, clockwise. And you need to do uh, one-fourth turns or quarter turns, half turns, and three-fourths turns. So we need to understand these fractions before we can do this. So any circle, you can divide into parts. And if you divide it into four parts, these are fourths. So if you're turning one-fourth turn, it would be just that much. Okay, one-fourth. If you're doing half a turn, it means you're going around half the circle. So let's say I'm starting here, doing a half turn, it would go this way. That's a half turn clockwise. And for a three-fourths turn, it means you're going around three of the four sections when we divide this into four. Three out of the four sections you're going around. Let's do our three-fourths turn counterclockwise. We're going to start it here. And three-fourths, one, two, three-fourths all the way around. And you may notice for a half turn, you went two sections, that's because two out of four is the same as a half. So now we can take a look at the questions. Number one says face north, do a one-fourth turn clockwise, mark it with the letter B. Okay, here we go. So here we are and we are uh, standing in the middle of this circle and we need to face north and uh, CW means clockwise so we need to go clockwise by one-fourth of a turn okay so basically what they're doing here is they're tricking you into making rays okay so here you are you're facing north and you need to go clockwise one-fourth of a turn Let's quickly remember the one-fourth, if you divide the circle into fourths, one-fourth would just be one section. So to go clockwise by one-fourth of a turn, you would go this way by one-fourth of a turn. And here we're supposed to mark the letter B, is what it says. Okay. So now let's take a look at number two. Now we're still facing north, so we're going to face the same direction. This time we're doing a three-fourths turn clockwise. And we're going to mark that with the letter C. Okay, so clockwise three-fourths of a turn. And again, we're still facing north, and we're going to go three-fourths, one, two, three and we're going to mark the letter C. Number three, we are facing east, and now we're going to do a one-fourth turn or quarter turn counterclockwise. 
So we are facing east, and we're now going to go counterclockwise, the opposite of a clock, counterclockwise, by one fourth of a turn. And where would you put that letter? Okay, number four, I think by now you should be able to do on your own. Number five is a little bit uh, trickier. So now we're again facing north, and we're going to go clockwise turn. But we need to go more than half a turn less than a three-fourths turn, and mark it with an F. Okay, so again, more than a half turn, less than a three-fourths turn. So again, it said we're facing north, and more than a half turn, less than three-fourths of a turn. So let's make our quarters again to check this. And again, we're going clockwise. So, more than a half. Here's a half, right? Clockwise, half, but less than three-fourths. So, anywhere along here would be appropriate for your letter F. And then number six is similar, uh, but try that one on your own. And when you're done with this homework tonight, you'll have uh, six letters around the outside somewhere. Uh, B, C, D, E, F, and G, I believe. So you're just trying to work on which way you're facing, which way is clockwise, like a clock, counterclockwise, the opposite, and how much are you turning. Again, if you turn uh, a fourth turn, it would be that much, a half a turn would be half the circle, and three-fourths of a turn would be three-fourths of the circle. So good luck, and if you have questions, please post them. Thank you.